Good morning. Today is the third Sunday in Lent. Lent is a season when we think about how much Jesus loves us and how we can follow him. During Lent, we will listen to stories about Jesus' life and how he taught and cared for people. Did you know that Jesus told lots of stories when he was on earth as a way to teach us? Jesus' stories are called parables. A parable is a simple story that tells a lesson. This morning's story is one of them. But before we can listen to one of God's stories, we need to get ready to hear one of God's stories. God asks us to become quiet within so we can hear God speaking to us. Now let's sing the words that Jesus says to us. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God. I wonder if this is a parable. Might be. Parables are very precious, like gold. And this box is gold. This looks like a present. And parables are like presents. They have already been given to us. We can't buy them or take them or steal them. They are already ours. There's another reason why this might be a parable. It has a lid. And sometimes parables seem to have lids on them. But when you lift the lid of a parable, there is something very precious inside. Let's take off the lid and see if this is a parable. I wonder what this is, or what it could be. It is the color yellow. It could be a bright yellow sun. Or it could be a big yellow ball. Once there was someone who said such amazing things and did such wonderful things that people began to follow him. As they followed, he told them about a kingdom, the kingdom of heaven. But they did not understand. They had never been to such a place, and they didn't know anyone who had. They didn't even know where it was. So one day they simply asked him, What is the kingdom of heaven like? And he said, The kingdom of heaven is like the grain of a mustard seed, which someone took and sowed into the field. It is the smallest of all seeds, and it grew and it grew and it grew when it has grown the mustard is the greatest of shrubs and becomes a tree so that the birds of the air come and they make nests 
in the tree. I wonder if these birds have names. I wonder how these birds feel about this tree. I wonder where the birds were coming from. I wonder what this tree might really be. I wonder where this whole place might really be. Will you please pray with me? Heavenly Father, we sometimes think we are too small to be important in the kingdom of God. Help us to remember the parable of the mustard seed and that you can use even the smallest of us to grow the kingdom and bring change and love to this world. And all of God's children say, Amen.